Yo, what is up, my people? Hope you guys having a great day and a great week so far. Right here, I have a skill build for you guys. We're doing uh, five directives, and this build is phenomenal, okay? With the recent changes, they changed the way that the NPCs do damage to the skills, and now uh, allowing the assault drone and a lot of these other skills to survive a lot longer and take a lot more damage, all right? This build right here, I utilize, and I stay in cover. I try to play it smart. Um, I have all five directives, like I said. So when you use one skill, the other skill is going to disappear. But the build lets you regenerate the skill real quick. Less than like 15 seconds, 12 seconds. And um, yeah, this absolutely melts any enemies you're playing against. And right here, I'm using five directive as an example. Look at this. Look at this dog, bro. Look at this warhound. And this warhound absolutely gets melted. And that's the skills doing all the work right now. I'm using a few other items that I'm going to break down the best I can to you. This is so simple to use that I can literally emote on a heroic five directive. Like, you know, I don't have to worry about nothing. I don't have to set up too much. You know, I am smart, so I get in cover. I, I try my best to play the cover. But, yo, if you're looking for a dope ass skill build, I think this is one of the best skill builds right now with the new changes to the game. And yeah, I'm just trying to bring you some dope content. I really do hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. Make sure you follow the Twitch. Turn on the notifications with the little bell icon. And I appreciate the support, guys. We're almost at six, 17K subscribers on YouTube. And dude, Twitch, I, I don't even know what to tell you guys about Twitch, man. It's just been amazing over there on Twitch, playing every day with the team, getting everybody in the grandma, sister, auntie, eagle bears. It feels good, man. All right, let's get it, baby. Let's go. Yo, what is good, my people? Hope you guys having a great day. Um, this is what I'm using right now, and this allows me to use skill and weapon damage. But I want to introduce to you the build that I was suggested by uh, MA2 Sanders. And Music Man, I want to thank them for uh, giving me the inspiration and the ideas of making a beautiful build, right? But this is what I was suggested by them. And this build absolutely melts. You get nice fat turret damage around uh, 126,000 per shot. So not bad. And right here is just straight skill damage. So we're rocking uh, three hardwired. You can rock it however you want. Skill damage. You could craft these really easily. And then, uh, yeah, he's using it for skill haste and skill damage. And then we have uh, the Hana backpack with skill haste, skill damage. Uh, combined arms is really good. I'm using perfect combined arms for 30%. And you just have to shoot at enemies. So it's really easy. And it gives you a 30% skill damage for three seconds. And the thing about this buff is that you can keep 100% uptime on it. So as long as you're shooting an enemy over and over, those three seconds will be extending, right? So it'll be three seconds. You shoot it. If you shoot it like right before it goes away, it'll refresh and then it'll continue to refresh, right? So right here, we're using two hand on this build and skill damage is the focus across everything. That way you could get the most damage out of your drone and your uh, turret, right? So right here, we have some more skill damage, skill haste, and then glass cannon, all right? You can also use kinetic momentum if you wanted to, but I personally enjoy a uh, glass cannon. I like addition that amplified damage okay but that's just my opinion and my suggestion okay you can rock whatever you want i'm using surge with this build because uh it gives me perfect spike and this allows me to get 25 percent more skill damage on headshots so i'm getting like 55 percent extra skill damage when i'm using uh, my build properly right so with that being said that's about all for this build right here with uh sweet dreams to one tap enemies and then technician for that uh beautiful extra damage to enemies extra skill damage quite a few reasons we're using this right skill damage and then you get a uh, extra skill tier which i'll explain to you in a second and then 12 percent damage to drones and uh, robots okay so right here i'm gonna go ahead and switch over make sure you always have your damage to your weapon because this really does make a difference okay 15 percent is a pretty pretty decent amount of uh buff right so here we go this is what i have come up with myself just using the inspiration from the build that was given to me the thing with this man is that like i like hardwired i just feel like i lose a lot i don't know if it's just in my mind but like 
I do go down by um I want to say like 10 like 6000 exactly 6000 uh, damage on my drone and my turret goes down by like 9000 right which really isn't that bad in my opinion so 9000 less damage per bullet but you also are picking up weapon damage okay so weapon damage is really good because we're already using glass cannon all right so i don't like kinetic momentum myself it is a good talent but i'm just like i don't know i'm just a crazy damage dude right i just like doing damage i don't know how to explain it all right so we're running technician for that extra yellow on this build all right so that allows us to put in some more damage if you're more of a different type of player and you want to play a little bit different and uh use armor by all means you can use armor you'll get almost to 1 million armor if you uh use a blue instead of a red okay you'll be like a nine something 970 or something like that 970 instead of a 7k or 700k um so right here i will explain this real quick i am using one murakami not only because it's god road but also because it gives me skill duration all right i feel like skill duration works really good with this build since i want the skills to do work right i want them to stay out for a long time and absolutely destroy anybody's booty cheeks okay so right here we're going with three hana and once again that's for weapon damage all right that's also your choice man you can run whatever else you want i personally like this setup like this and i'm bringing you that heat that i use all right so if i use it i try to bring it to you if i don't really use it i don't really uh post it too much so skill haste skill damage skill haste skill damage on the two piece of hana so if you just wanted to use two i'm using three for weapon damage once again and i'm getting skill haste and skill damage on that set on that uh third extra item right so with uh hardwired you only get skill damage you know what i'm saying so i don't know i think the skill haste is pretty cool for when i break my skill it gives me that super short cooldown right that's that's what you want on a 14 second cooldown when you break your skill okay so right here we also have wyvern for skill damage skill haste skill damage pretty simple um and then lastly i have my beautiful uh fox prayers that gives me damage to targets out of cover and this is multiplicative damage and then uh yeah i just roll skill damage on this also that way the build could slap okay guys so i feel like i'm slapping with this build i'll go over the weapon once again the surge this is a rifle a named item and this gives me a headshots grants 25 percent skill damage which is phenomenal in my opinion so paired with uh combined arms you're getting that 50 and then you also got glass cannon giving you more amplified damage dudes fox prayers amplifying more damage and it's just i love this build right now man i'm enjoying it a lot and then a sad man so sad man for the sweet dreams play your position play smart i feel like uh technician is the best for this class you know if you like using demo and and the uh, turret that goes boom you know i i totally understand if you like using the artillery uh turret man so you know what i'm saying do you and i appreciate you guys watching my content the watch helps you a lot but you know i don't i don't really want to say too much because like the watch depends on how much time you have to play and what you're doing in the game like you know if you're playing normal all the time or hard you're not getting that much xp like the dudes playing heroic and legendaries all the time before ending the video i feel like i should show you guys a, a few things just in case uh, you missed it or you didn't understand me so i'm gonna go ahead and set this up all right so first off one thing is that when you shoot the head you get two buffs off this build okay so the body you can shoot but you're only gonna get one buff which is combined arms and both of these buff have a uh, 100% uptime if you're hitting your shots, right? So they'll never go away as long as you're hitting your shots, okay? And this is increasing your skill damage by 55%, okay? Which is very beautiful in my opinion. So we're going to let both of these buffs go away. And I'm going to show you right now. So right now, my turret is going to hit for, let's see is doing 89,000 damage per shot. So when I shoot the head, we're gonna see 55% increase in damage. So now we're doing 131 damage instead of 87, so. And you could keep this up the whole time and you're also doing damage because you have 
a semi damage build all right so you're still doing damage we just hit for 500k right there on a headshot which isn't too bad and you can keep this up the whole time so i want to make sure you guys know this and once we combine this with our turret we're gonna wait we're gonna delete our uh our one skill and we're gonna see how much our turret's hitting for without any buffs 146 which is phenomenal right so right here we're going into the 200s you ready 215 right here while we have damage on our weapon also so 215 and then we add our homie into the mix so 215 plus some hundreds in there and we're we're zooming baby <laughs> we're killing everybody dog this man is invulnerable losing all his health bro let's go dude this man would have been bodied a million times but yeah, that, this is how I want you to use the build, okay, boys? So make sure you're using uh, your Q&E, Q&E gaming. Anytime you see a target that you want to uh, focus on, you just have to, you know, Q&E it, okay? But yeah, this guy is this guy is a buddy. Let's let's see how fast we take out. Uh, see how fast we take out a named enemy. All right, name that enemy. Q and D. And he should be dead. All right, awesome. That's a name boss, by the way. Let's get it. All right, one more time. We will go ahead and we will mess with this right here. <clears throat> and I'm going to keep trying to keep them buffed while they do their thing, yo. Beautiful. Yeah, I want to say thank you for watching my video and my content over here on YouTube and Twitch. Everything uh, division related. I love you guys, man. I'll catch you over on the channel later. We're going to be uh, raiding and probably doing some more stuff. I don't know, maybe some PvP here and there. But uh, we'll figure it out, man. Thank you guys. Leave all your comments and any opinions in the comment section. And yeah, man, stay blessed. Salute. And I'll catch you later. Peace, baby. Let's get it.